Hey everyone, I wanted to go over some new and perhaps not so exciting news that we got for Monster Hunter Rise on the PC. And that's the fact that Capcom and the official Monster Hunter Twitter account, at the very least in North America, went ahead and addressed that they are experiencing and are at the least being reported on that there's some issues regarding the game on the PC build. According to their tweets, they say, Hunters, we're aware that some of you have been experiencing various issues in Monster Hunter Rise's demo on Steam. We're currently investigating for potential updates for their full game's release. Thank you so much for taking the time to write in your feedback. And then they continue further. We'll be updating you once we have more information to share. In the meantime, we encourage you to review our Steam forums thread dedicated to troubleshootings and issue reporting. So in their first original tweet, they don't actually mention what the issues actually are being addressed and what people are actually reporting. I guess that's smart on them to actually not let the public know what the real issues are that people have been reporting. And then interestingly enough, they subsequently follow that up with saying that pretty much you have to check out the troubleshooting page in order to be able to have information, which is funny enough because all that actually says is, you know, typical stuff like, have you run this plugin? Have you updated your graphic card? Have you reset your computer if it's crashing? And a little basic stuff like that, which isn't necessarily directly tied to the game or performance itself. What people have been reporting is that the game pretty much has been crashing for a lot of users. There has been a lot of graphical variations, let's say, where basically just stuff does not necessarily look right. There have been people reporting mouse incidents where essentially the mouse is just not necessarily responding all that well. There's just, again, a lot of popping and log issues, min maps and stuff like that. Just graphical settings that are just not necessarily translating all that well into the PC build of Steam, of course. And again, this is just a demo, so it's kind of expected that there were going to be like build issues and stuff like that. But, you know, again, this is why people have been reporting these problems and hopefully Capcom can go ahead and address them. Remember that the game is supposed to release on PC in mid-December, so pretty much they should be at the point of bug fixing, or at the very least, going over the notes of what people are actually reporting and addressing some of them. So, they do have time, but you know, we'll just have to wait and see in what state the game actually launches and runs. Ultimately, because PCs are so varied and it basically differs from build to build on how persons are setting them up, that, you know, these are kind of expected. It's not like the closed ecosystem of a console where you kind of already know that the build is just going to run the same on every single one of the systems. PC are, are very different in that regard. So we'll just have to wait and see what actual changes they make. But at, in one way, you can look at it this way. It is encouraging that they're acknowledging that there's an issue. And in others, you could have actually said, well, the game's actually been out for over a year now, or almost a year on another console. You know, it is what it is. And you should have done a better job actually getting ready for PC. So there are two ways to tackle it. But at the very least, I am somewhat encouraged that they're acknowledging that there are some issues with it. And hopefully they're going to be addressing them before the launch of the game. But until then, we don't really necessarily know how well that run, that build is actually going to run. So we'll just have to wait and see. But that's all the information that I have for you guys today. If you're still having issues with the PC build, definitely check out the link in the description below. I'm going to be linking it to their official uh, pretty much reporting tech troubleshooting page. So you can go ahead and report any sort of issues that you have and let them know about it because otherwise there's no way for them to actually know. But if you're brand new to my channel, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. Hit the bell to receive notifications when the videos go up. And as always, thank you so much for watching. See ya.